Hello everyone, my name is Michael Young and welcome back to Factorio using the C-Block mod pack. So we're still working on this acid factory and we're getting some real feature creep. Things are um, getting much more complicated than I intended and I'm a little concerned that hydrofluoric acid is not building as much as I, as I would hope given the amount of sulfuric and nitric acid we're making. I mean ideally we don't need as much hydrofluoric acid but Still, it's a concern. Anyway, um, I was just trying. I'm trying to work myself up to um, a plan for all the sulfuric wastewater. Do I even have a? I don't. We're just um, clarifying tons and tons of sulfuric wastewater away because they, we don't need as much for this. And in fact, it looks like this is mostly backed up. Which means we screwed up our ratios somewhere. What's the hold up? Oh, are we out of... We are. Okay. So that was all held up because we were out of this. We, we, we're definitely going to need to make some more um, account of this little factory somewhere. Yeah, I'm not sure how to do that. Anyway. Hopefully that should get things moving. We'll make even more nitric acid. Although this is gonna fill up soon. Uh, I don't want to clarify sulfuric acid. We'll just we'll let it we'll let it stop. We'll let the whole thing roll to a halt because I expect in the future we're gonna be burning more sulfuric acid than anything else. So I'll leave it there. Anyway, so I wanted to go ahead and I have a plan. At least I'm starting to work on a plan. So it's all the alternate way of th the alternate thing you can do with all this um, cellulose fiber from the sulfuric acid and carbon dioxide is to make multi-phase oil, and from there we have raw gas, which gives us acid gas, which we can throw right into our old system, back to there, and this natural gas liquids, which can turn into methane um, through multiple methods. The ethane and butane, I don't want to do anything with. But methane, we can just burn, or we can turn it to methanol. But um, I don't, I don't want to go crazy. I'm thinking eventually we might have, um, we might have like multiple, uh, so a setup similar to this, generating sulfuric wastewater so that we can create like plastic and that kind of thing. But for now, uh, th that's not the point of this. Or should it be? No, I don't, I don't want to. I, would, I don't want to have everything coupled together. I, I want separation. If needs be, we can like, grab this entire factory and just make another copy of it and append something different over here. But yeah, I'm thinking we're going to create a bunch of methane and turn it into solid fuel. Um, there, and we'll just flare away the other components. We're also going to get the crude oil, which we will be able to turn into base mineral oil. And there's different rates of that. This is the best one. Base mineral oil using um, crude oil from residual gas. Uh, residual gas and crude oil to get more base mineral oil. The extra fuel oil will burn into, um, well, we'll convert that over to solid fuel also. And where am I going? The extra naphtha. Um, we could turn to more base mineral oil, but that requires thermal water, which needs lithium. So no, no. We'll just, um, we'll make do with the excess naphtha. Maybe we'll turn it into synthesis gas. I like that. We'll turn it into synthesis gas, which will let us create better, more methane. So this can be like a huge power station. Like right here, we're going to have just like a ton of things producing um, steam. Anyway, let's go ahead and just start figuring this out. So the first step of this, the very first step, is creating blue algae. And we have this little pattern with these eight. Let me, see, let me get this out. It ends up at the bottom for some reason, or at the top. So we said we were going to use 60 sulfuric wastewater per second to produce blue algae. We actually have in total, where is it? 160. So we have a lot more sulfuric wastewater that we could be using. 
And um, this process is lossy, but it's not that lossy. It gives me back sulfuric wastewater. Let's see. So we would be spending 100 turns into 40. And then those 40 will turn into 20. And then the 20 turns it back into 60 wastewater. So it loses 40% every time it runs through. But still, with, with a huge incoming supply, this will keep going for quite a bit. Oh, my bots are still busy. Placing out more concrete. I'm gonna I, I'm gonna need more of these. I already started building. I guess I guess I finished. Anyway, so I'm just trying to figure out ratios. I know it's gonna be the same ratio to start with. It's two of these per one of these to make the blue cellulose fiber. We're gonna need steam from somewhere. I know we're gonna be generating a bunch of it from the methane eventually, but that's down the line. We'll need like a way to get into the system in the first place. The layout's gonna be weird too. I'm trying. I was trying to think: should I put it down here? But I don't think there's enough room. I'm gonna keep, just keep going sideways. So, all right, let's start doing some numbers. Yeah, this is what I was trying to work out before. The blue fiber into multiphase oil, the multiphase oil into gas and crude, the raw gas into acid and natural gas, the natural gas into methane, using synthesis when possible. I didn't, I didn't finish flushing it out. I was, I, I got, kind of got frustrated. <laughs> anyway, we'll figure it out now. So, we already worked this out. This bit. I'm just going to copy it down. And we're saying we're going to have the other, uh, other, what, 62.5% of it. Ah, uh, but that's the wrong number. It's that times. Where is it? That. So 100 sulfuric wastewater per second, which can produce 40 blue algae. That would need 13 of these. We're not going to use all 13. I'm thinking 8. I'm thinking another 8. So let's switch that back to 0.375. And we know it's going to be for two, but the next step is what I'm looking at. It takes place in an oil refinery. Which ones do I have access to yet? I have access to threes. We need titanium, but that's okay. We can make it. And it's quite an increase. It's 1, 1 to 1.75 to 2.5. That's a nice linear upgrade pattern. Out of green circuits of all things. <laughs> anyway, we'll work on that. So, uh, 20 fiber and 100 steam is 100 multi phase in 5 seconds. It's something that's going to be of speed 2, or speed 2.5. Uh, that one. Stupid Google trying to be helpful. Uh, that divided by that. No. It's that divided by that. So we need 50 steam a second. That's fine. I just want to see uh, how much I need. So we're producing 12 fiber, and this consumes 10 fiber. I'm inclined just to let go of that, rather than trying to make a second one. in this ratio more perfect. Like, what if I were to use the, the 1.75 ones? Then it would be 7 each. Slightly better to be used to. Now, let's just leave like this. Alright. 
Um, I'll, I can use the bots to help out. If they weren't all busy. Um... What am I doing? So like that, right there. The whole um, nitrogen is going to be separate. We might actually have trouble getting it, getting stuff around uh, these uh, air filters, but we can make that work eventually. Like, I'm betting that doesn't reach. Nah, nowhere, nowhere close. Do I not have any? I do, it's just in the wrong place. Carbon. Sure, get that too. I probably need to go more into military science, just so I can um, eventually get like rockets and stuff. Okay, and this is gonna feed. What's the next step? The fires? We did it over here. We used chem plants. I know I have chem plants somewhere. There they are. And we'll mirror this whole thing in a moment. Okay, um, chem plant making... It's still... No, it's gonna be different. It's, uh, no, it's just fiber. We might have talked about Alright. And then that's all gonna feed... A, uh, that's going to feed the oil refinery. Does it need water at all? Like, no, I guess not. Okay. Where's that refinery made? Alright. How far does that reach? Probably not far enough. No. What if it were like that? Still good. Now that's gonna be fine actually. Alright. It's carbon dioxide in the middle. I think that's how we did it before, right? Oh well. In this case, we had to have a lot more room between the two. But that worked nicely, so I'm not going to complain. In fact, maybe I should do two of these. Hmm. Nah, this is fine. Let's go ahead and hook that up. Is going? 
They're not getting carbon dioxide. They should be. Oh. For some reason that didn't work. And this isn't getting wastewater. None of it's getting wastewater. We used up all our wastewater. Because this is full of sulfuric acid. Oh, yeah. Hmm. That's an issue. Do I want to flare away this sulfuric acid? Kind of no. But sort of yes. That is so loud. Stop being so loud. I don't know why it's all stopped. It should still be going. It's not full. Not enough hydrogen sulfide gas. Too much. Oh, we probably ran out down here also. Yeah. I need to get that going. Okay, I'm going to... I'm going to put a little flare here. Shouldn't go very often, I hope. But if this... If the sulfuric acid backs up all the way to here, we'll start getting rid of it. Just to continue our, um, so the hydrochloric acid, hydrochloric acid, hydrofluoric acid. Anyway. There's the sulfuric waste bar coming in again. We'll need to go get some more silver and aluminum at some point. I hadn't really thought about how long this is going to take to make. But whatever. It's for a grand cause. Oh, we don't have any steam here. I. Uh. That's a little messy. How are we gonna do this? Um. I was thinking it was in pipes, with the aluminum, but no. Um, not the aluminum. What am I saying? Like the ammonia. Hmm. Uh, let's bring it out more and face it downwards. I like that. This feels really crude. I don't know. Oh well. It'll it'll probably work. Um so no steam to make this work yet, but we know we know what the outputs will be, so we can deal with them. Uh, I kind of wish these two were switched. OK. 
Okay. Sulfuric waste water is out. CO2. We'll feed back into here. And it's just the um, the uh, multi-phase oil that we need to deal with now. And the steam, of course. Um, what's the first thing we're going to get? Eventually, what's the best way to get the steam? From the naphtha, perhaps? Well, we're going to need a, um, an oil and gas separator, first of all. Now we can be more sulfuric acid to deal with. Or sulfuric wastewater. Okay, we said we were going to be producing with 10 fiber. We're limiting to 10. We're going to be producing 15 multi-phase oil per second. So this is 100 multi-phase becomes 20 raw gas and 70 crude oil. And that's in two seconds? That's fast. Okay. That, this is going to be a concern. Okay, we'll put it... Let's see which one we have access to. Oil and gas separator. We can do a, a 3, which is a speed 2. So we can deal with 100 multi-phase oil, which is more than we need. So let's not do a phase a, a 2. Let's do a... Um, we can get away with a, with a, a 1, but probably better do a 2. Just to be, just to have some excess capacity. So it'll be uh, speed 1.5. We're actually going to only give it 50. So like that. So we're getting 10 raw gas and 50 over 75 times 52.5 that much crude oil per second and let's go get the supplies for that it's just, we just need much more greens I think my factory is like stopped I don't know why the research is going so slowly it's just the gold I think yeah just the gold on 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 which component? On this component? Really? Anyway. But like, we have... These are all filled full up again. Look at that. All that mineral sludge replenished. We should burn it on something. I should get bots going again. They were all stopped because of... A lack of lubricant. Let's go ahead and make some space and get some lubricant going. Yeah. Kind of the exact same problem I'm having right now. Uh, okay. A way to get base mineral oil faster. Now it's all quiet. It was all being loud for a while and I was all, Turn the music down, I can't hear anything. There you go. We do have all this residual gas up here. We can Oh, we're out. Too much naphtha right here. Yeah, we're doing the exact same recipe as we are doing down there. Um, 
are we doing with an app that we're making wood? I think. Way at the bottom? Alright, that should go again. Yeah, that wasn't even very much, but that's fine. You don't need that much. Excuse me, excuse me. Now our our entire base can get busy making more robots. Gotta place that uh, concrete up faster. Although apparently they're done right now. How far, how much further can we do with this? Only that far. Let's see. I should be getting the, like, the next tier of these. That like have a ridiculous speed. Or a distance. But whatevs. That work? Yeah. Apparently, I have a bunch of bots still busy. Just none, none, none without things to do. If that made any sense at all. That should open up more area to construct it, though I guess not. Alright. That should help out. Now the bots are busy again. They never got to this over here. My bots can not do it though. So we can drive right into the ocean. This still isn't filled. Ah, I, I keep thinking maybe I should have put more Tianon down. I think we're going to need to put more Tianon down no matter what, but it's a little annoying. Oh well. Should I start storing the sulfuric acid? Just so we can have a bit more space that we're not flaring it away. Um, we would need lots of pumps. More engines. As chance would have it, I just got some engine production going. Oh, I moved something. Okay. Alright. What do I think? Maybe two per?
This is unnecessary extravagance, but whatever. Okay, I didn't put them in the right order. Whatevs. Ah, it looks like we're not pumping fast enough. Or it's not filling evenly. That's fine. You'll get to it eventually. Interesting, there's no interface. I thought there was like... A thing. Where you could like, connect tanks and stuff. Yeah, it didn't even cut into the supply that much. Oh well. Let's just keep going here. We don't want to not make any progress today. So... We now have a bunch of multi-phase oil. Or we will. We're going to connect it to a gas separator. Which I made. I know I made it right there. I don't know if I like this layout. It's it seems a little messy to me. Kind of janky or something. But oil is always like that. Too many pipes. Alright. Um I kinda want the gas to go up this way. What do I do with the gas? I put it through a gas refinery or an advanced gas refinery to split it. Okay, how much is it? It's a slow recipe. We're getting um, to only 10 per second. And this handles one, one of them is going to be sufficient no matter how, how slow it is. Um, so we'll just make a nice one. But not a too nice one. And the oil... Well, okay, after that, we have to deal with the natural gas liquids. The natural gas liquids happens in a, another gas refinery that's the same speed, and it handles more. We're going to need two, though, one for each recipe. Okay, so two more gas refineries, which I don't have supplies for. What is that, brass? Yeah, it's brass. Alright. How many more pipes, probably? Also. Go ahead, give it to me. Alright, I want to send this acid gas back here. No, all the way back here. So, we'll have to move it again. One, two, three, four.
Uh, I guess like that's fine. We'll take out the oil out here. All right. It's even facing the right way. How convenient. All right. And then the uh, the what is it called? Natural gas liquids. More water treatment, maybe? It's so cheap. It's only thirty. Might as well just start getting everything. We're gonna run out of blue science to do before we um, before we get to the next science thing because of this, this distraction that we're working on right now. Okay, the natural gas liquids, there's two things to do with them. I don't know why it keeps on taking back to the nitrogen. So we're going to have one that this produces methane from natural gas liquids, and another that produces um, methane from synthesis gas also, whenever there's synthesis gas available. So we'll need like a mini tank and some uh, some some circuits. Just a small inline tank. I'm not quite sure where it's gonna go yet. It's gonna go somewhere where we have natural um, we have synthesis gas being made. How do we want to do that? We'll need to use a pump, I guess. A pair of pumps. So we'll be, go like out like this, and then we'll have a pump going down and a pump going up. For my pumps. It's not even those that tier of pump. Never mind. There. I have a bunch anyway. Hold on. And then the two steam crackers. Or not steam crackers. Whatever they are. Actually, this isn't going to work. It has to be a different. Has to be a different facility. What is this happening in? Um, this is a gas refine. No, these are gas refineries. How is it going to take two inputs? I think that's a lie. This, this facility isn't going to work. We need like an advanced one. How do those compare? They're slower. We'll go ahead and make a titanium one. But this one, we'll just go ahead and do the normal gas fraction. Okay, the, the methane is what we want. I can't don't quite know it. I think this is the methane. Top one. Yeah. Yeah, the top. Okay, I could just look at the recipe. But the bottom two will flare away. Uh, well, actually, we're going to connect this to something else. So let's, let's see how that looks. We'll, we'll just have one flare for, for each output. The methane, first and foremost, we're going to turn into steam to power this. So that's some of... I know I have some. Some of these.
It does need water too. Oh. Okay. So we'll just blow up some ground. That's so convenient that you can do that, by the way. I really like it. I screwed that up. Oh well. And that's not going to work either. How am I going to get the methane up? Hmm. I guess that will do. that in down there. Unnecessary, but prettier looking. And this will be our input. We'll just like add a bit of of, um, of methane right here, and that will get the whole thing going. But this isn't finished yet. We have we just made the other advanced factory, which is so much bigger. Wow. Let's see what side it is. I'm betting it's the wrong one. Hey, it's the right one. Who'd have thought? We're getting a little hemmed in here. But that's okay. We can make it work. Yeah, this isn't as pretty as like the rest of this little area because we hadn't really prototyped it. Oh well. So it's giving me carbon monoxide, right? We'll just flare that away, no question. This comes out one, this comes out two, this comes out three. I wonder if I should just make two of these, just, just for the symmetry of it. I think I will. Unnecessary, but it's the kind of thing that bothers me. Is that a three? That's a two. So this would be speed 2, this is only speed 1.5, it's actually making it slower by making it look more symmetrical. Oh well. I don't care, I, want, I just want it to look a little better than it does right now. might need to be one higher. I'm thinking maybe it needs to be one higher. Hmm. 
no, it works. Works fine. So this will be the normal fractioning. This will be the enhanced fractioning with the, with the synthesis gas. That's not connected, right? Yeah, that's fine. All right. Flare that away. And we have to flare both those away also. Like that. And the methane. Did I not do that right? This has two methane outputs. I did that wrong. You're right. We'll be flaring that away there, but we could just do it. Hmm. Let's take a look at this better. Uh, we need to flare away right here. How are we going to do that? Without it looking terrible. Like that. And then like that. I like it. But yeah, this has two methane outputs. How weird. Just to make it fit. I suppose. Alright. Now we can just take this higher. Alright. And that's connected, this is connected, everything is hooked up, except we want the methane eventually to do other stuff out here, and we need this, this uh, oil to do other stuff. So, oil. No. This is going to be happening in another oil refinery, of course. Let's go grab some green and bricks. What are you doing? I keep seeing these. These stupid bots that are sitting in a charging area holding a brick. And I have no idea why. Why would you be carrying a brick? I bet you picked up a brick and you don't know where to put it. Like, no, I don't know why. Interesting. Stupid bot. Ah, uh, it's filling up a little bit. Um... I was grabbing some bricks. And some steel.
Let's get some steam. Just kind of randomly. I'm sure we have some steam somewhere. Maybe. Here's another one. Stupid bot holding a brick. Forever. You know, maybe we're not making steam anywhere. Uh. Well, we can force it to steam with a. Not methanol. With this naphtha. Yeah, we can turn naphtha into steam. If we have water. Really? I'm not producing? Hmm. Wait a minute, we have to be doing some for the exact same thing at reason. Yeah, right here, we're making some steam. Okay. I like how it shows the steam kind of settling like it was water. Uh, I just want to steal some steam so we get this whole process started. I hope we can. We can't kill hold steam. I guess that kind of makes sense. Never mind. I'm an idiot. Uh, you wanted to steal some methane, then. Are we making methane? We're not. Well, we can fake it. We can fake it. We can make some steam out of nothing if we need to. In case we ever need it again. Looks like we're having trouble with iron ore. Probably because we have too much copper stored up somewhere. Looks like we're having trouble with aluminium too. Hmm. Anyway. We never got around to making modules. Is this still going? Looks like it's out of lubricant again. Oh, this doesn't have anywhere to insert the bots anymore because we haven't moved it. Let's put it back. There we go. Just real quick, just to insert a single barrel of steam, or well, the equivalent of a barrel of steam. I can never find anything I want.
There you go. Just to get that process kickstarted. Maybe that wasn't even enough. Okay, yeah, it's enough. We got the oil here now. Okay, so refinery. And actually, do we need two of these? Yeah, we're gonna need two of these because we have two oil recipes. It's the exact same thing as up here, and we're gonna have to um to go ahead and do lo circuit logic there too. Right here needs to be where the synthesis gas comes. Maybe we should go. Facing down? I don't know. What do we do with residuals? Also need steam. Hmm. That's in a steam cracker. This. These are both in refineries. Dealing with the naphtha and turning it into synthesis gas is in a steam cracker also. So we need one more of these refineries. And then two steam crackers. Actually used up all our titanium. Excuse me. I guess we could just use an electric boiler to get the small amount of steam we need to get things started. Yeah, that wasn't very clever of me. Oh well. So, we're going to have the oil come out. And then we'll have it piped both ways, pumped both ways. And then we'll decide which way we want it to go based on circuit stuff. side is this going to be on the wrong side uh, can we put the steam cracker between them when it gets here let's put it down one too well we could no no actually this works fine this works fine We'll just do this one on this side. They both will output residual, which we'll need to deal with. crackers like this it has two inputs but it only needs one right yeah the steam Maybe I should reverse that. We can take the base mineral oil away right away. Um, let's do that. Yeah.
All right. The steam cracker we'll put right in front of it. Could make it into synthesis gas. Yeah, this needs synthesis gas, right? No. This needs synthesis gas. Hmm. But we're not producing enough residual to matter. I say make it getting synthesis gas process. There's the next tier roboport, the titanium roboport. Sure, we're gonna need it for space stuff. This will just be making residual. We can make the synthesis gas directly um, somewhere else. Well, right here. You know. From naphtha. Alright, I think that'll work. We still need to hook up the logic to make it make these operate correctly. But that'll work. Uh, we were gonna make a couple more of these. This might not be making steam fast enough. Like what's the recipe? It's ninety steam every one second. In a speed one thing. And these need 100 steam every four seconds. So, yeah, that's fine. We'll just put a couple of them down just the same way as we did up there. Um, trying to think of the best way to do this. It kind it kind of doesn't fit very well. can use the fuel oil too. We should do one of each perhaps. Um Sure, we can make that work. This piping is not clean. I hate when it gets like this. And it often seems to.
Oh, this has residual gas also. Sure. I think it's fine. Let me make a, um, a boiler. Where is that? No, it's not one of those. It's this one, the electric boiler. Just a first, and we're gonna be producing far more um, naphtha and bit in this stuff than uh, we need at first. And methane. So let's go ahead and store those as intermediate products. So I should make more of these also, by the way. Not the cleanest work, but it will do. I'm wondering if I should force some methane here first. Uh, might might be nice. Well, I don't know. I just want to get this nice and well set up and some, some stuff collected here. There we go. Okay, this isn't done yet, but we're making some real progress, I'm thinking. We'll have to deal with the excess stuff being accumulating right here, but this should, should be giving us a ton of base mineral oil over time. So, thank you everyone for watching. Sorry for going so long today. Till next time.